Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We are back live tonight. We had a little technical issues last night, but on behalf of Wisconsin Rapids Community Media and Hockey TV, we're proud to bring you tonight's game. We got the round two of the, you know, Rum River Mallards and your River Kings, you know. So, Mark wasn't here last night, missed a 4 1 victory. You know, not really a, you know, barn burner of a game, but a very well played game. Let's put it that way. Yeah, I was talking to you guys before the game, and it sounded like they got off to a little bit of a slow start last night, but uh, turned it on in the second and third periods and made, you know, took care of business. And let's see if they can start off. Looks like they changed up their starting lineup just a little bit tonight. To, we'll see. Maybe that was a maybe a way to get the things started a little quicker tonight. So. Yeah, they, they weren't a, I mean, it wasn't a complete sluggish game, but it was a game that they, you know, Rum River came out to play the first period. So as far as that's concerned, we'll see what they do for tonight. We got new goalies both ends, different starting lineups on both sides. So this could be a completely, you know, different game altogether. Yeah, and it's, yeah. it's good to be back on the microphones with you guys, and we'll get a chance here. Now we've had a number of weekends in a row, home week, home weekends. We'll be able to do this every week, and um, I know it, it seems like when I've been at games, the River Kings have been a little sluggish in the second <laughs> period. And last night, it sounds like they took care, you know, like they weren't that way. So it'll be interesting. A couple of lineup changes, and yep, and a couple of shakeups in the roster, and we'll see what happens. Absolutely. Before the game starts, we were looking. Uh, Dan K show, if those don't know it, you know, they're a pretty popular show. Came out with their uh, basically all star team, and we got four guys from River Kings that came up with that. Yeah, Redmond, Pizzamente, Steer, and Allen all made their team. And as far as that, USHPL uh, player of the week was Jacob Yakus for last week, so bunch of honors. Well, the three, three of the guys you listed are the tied for number one in scoring for the River Kings. Absolutely. Pizzamente, Steer, and Redmond. No Redman on no Redman here tonight for us though. Alright, here we go. Drop that puck. Drop the puck. Let's go. Rum River collects that up and right away down in the zone. Zekti takes his guy off. Get this fast paced game right off the bat. Right down in the end. We spent a lot of time on Mallard's end last night, so it's a little quick shot there. Kurich and Brzecki back behind the net, both fighting for the puck. Got a little bit of a breakaway. Davis clicks his up, back out to Paget. Good burst of speed by Davis there to get back on defense. Ooh, quick little wrist shot by Paget on that one. Blocker save. So we'll see how the goalies, the goalies last night, you know, did what they needed to do. First period was tied up 1-1. Then third period, River King started the game, or third period, with 22, 23 shots on goal and ended the night with 50. So they pumped in you know, 20 plus shots in one period. <laughs> so, wow. we'll see how, well, that was a little knuckleball that hopped right in front of the goalie back there, and that's uh, Dodson back there tonight. We had Carroll last night, who newcomer right at the point with a quick wrist flip. Oh, Reese tried to get a stick on there, his defender kind of tied him up, couldn't get a stick down to newcomer point blank again, a big stop by Carroll again. Duke is going to see that one later on the film and want those two back. Yeah, that one for sure. He, <laughs> it looked like he was, if he'd have gone five hole there, it looked like he didn't ever got his legs together. He just shot it just right into the pad. Yeah, you go from, they got him at 5'10", 150. Last night, Carroll was 6 foot 170. So there's that size, and he got, you know, Blackburn's a tower back over on his side. So, I mean, it's a different perspective of goalie size. Ooh, and they gave that one up, and Newcomer gets that one, a little chip shot. Ooh, big shot by Yakuz tonight. Yakuz is playing with a cager, full fishbowl on tonight. That's a new look for him. Must have caught one. I know he caught one in the neck last night. Didn't look like it bothered him real bad, but he changed up and went with the, the bubble tonight. Give a little extra protection. Keep what teeth you have. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, try to get a tip. Armijo is right up in front. Cicilano collects that one back in the far corner. Tries to get that one back in the corner. Battling down there. Ooh, Armijo comes back out of there. He's got Grano right camped in front. Hogan right behind him. So, Tranquina out in the point. Putting an offensive pressure on right now. They've yeah. got to take advantage of it. They, if they're going to spend that much time down there, they need to put one on the board. 
Ooh, quick little flip. Ooh, that one bounced right in front of Blackburn, but Sis Lionel there to collect that one up, get that one out of the zone. And Grano flips that one down. Hogan down there with that burst of speed. He makes it look effortless. <laughs> Four or five strides, and he's already full speed down the other end of the ice. Grano's got his guy tied up in the corner. Roman River collects that one back up. Still battling down there. Joe Blair fighting with ex-teammate Matt Hall played a half a season here, so they know each other well. They were talking last night after the game. We got another partial line change in. Mitchell King's on the ice now, so. Yeah, we had him up in the booth last night. Ooh, wrist shot, that one blocked off shin guard, so. After the trivia questions we gave him last night, he probably is. <laughs> And that one just deflected off the back of the net, so they waved icing <laughs> off on that one. That's got to be nerve-wracking. We said that last night, to watch that puck coming down is just inches away from that net. Ooh, he got Rhodes right now on a little breakaway all by himself. Ooh, tried to nice little cross-check, and goalie stuffed it up, but that was a good play by Rhodes on that one. Broke away. Had a good shot. I mean, we already had five shots. I think it was Mitchell King, wasn't yep. it? Yeah. Yeah. Rhodes. Road Rhodes. Rhodes. <laughs> okay. I started to get more of the first name, so. Okay. We'll throw them all in there. How about that? Hey, that works. <laughs> Keep me on my toes. <laughs> You're way more familiar with the roster than I am. Cool. Rosecki flipped that right in front of the right in front of the net. Just floated there for a little bit. No one couldn't get there quick enough to get the puck. Davis tried to get a little hack shot at it. Carrich going in there, takes his guy off. Davis down there, keeps it in the zone. Got to help with Carrich back to who flips out to Brett. He's going in, a quick wrist shot. Took the stick right out of the defenseman with that one. Went high. Ooh, nice. I, I have developed a new goal sign or a new name too. It's called the Paget Poke Check. <laughs> he has got long it. Arm. He has got that poke check. Like right there is the instance. He just gives that just a little quick shot with that stick and he takes it off that, you know, the guy coming down with the puck and he does it, you know, all the time. Keep I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, there he goes. Pizmenti kept that one. Ooh, Reese stretched out and kept that one and flips it over. Ooh, Pizmenti was coming in on the far corner and just lost the handle. Yaku's with a, wasn't a full swing bomb, but ooh. That one bounced right behind the net. Still fighting back there. Their newcomer picked it up. Got Yaku's gonna flip another one in. Ooh, Bismenti got a tip on that one, but it just, just dropped it about chest high. Hit him right in the mallard. <laughs> Almost sounds like you're swearing. <laughs> quack, 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 quack. <laughs> yeah, if you'd got a little more of a wedge out of you know, we probably had a seven and needed a sand wedge on that one. He'd have tipped it right in. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the River Kings, you know, really dominating here. Let's see if they can take advantage and capitalize. Oh, nice save. Yeah, another big save. I mean, he's he's earning his keep back there right now. That's This is what the third period last night looked like. It wasn't just one shot on goal, change sides. It was 3-4 in a barrage. So the biggest thing that was hurting him last night was, you know, like every team, you get them wicked little rebounds that come off a pad. You know, he doesn't get a good glove on it or, you know, just deflected. We had a big goal, I think it was Pizzamente last night. Maybe he got that one, it was the deflection. Rum River coming out of there. Big blast went high. Blackburn just let that one float over. Ooh, newcomer tried to bounce it out. Kept in by Rum River. He's still fighting over in the back corner. That one's back behind there. Yakuz takes his guy off. Steer collects it up back behind the net. He's rolling forward. Fighting his guy all the way across the lines. He's got a handful of everything. And he does a little quick wrist shot. Then they fought every inch all the way down the ice. Armijo back behind the net, scrapping with the couple of them. Keeping it in, Hogan grabs it, collects it up. Oh, that one bounced right off, of, right off the pad of a rum river and bounced all the way down the River King's end. Sicily now gets behind the net, taking a little breather, get his guys a set up here. Yaku's coming up. First, clear out across the ice, Siciliano had to backtrack and dumps it in there. Hogan back there with Grano. Grano had a beautiful unassisted one last night. Another big slapper from the corner. And, you know, I mean, that's, that's putting some shots in six minutes. We got nine shots already. Yeah. I mean, 
Queen, not, I mean, clean shots. Yeah, I mean, clean it, shots and a couple of really good scoring opportunities. And goalie's been standing tall so far. That is just, it's almost like they're another big shot. And he's not giving up rebounds either. No, that's a, that's a huge one too. But this is one of those games is like they're almost like feeling them out. Where Where's the weak spot? You know, this could be, I'm not sure where, how long these guys have been, you know, they haven't seen each other since October. So this, you know, for scouting wise, I'm sure they probably got some film on them. They've watched some other stuff and know, you know, kind of where to shoot, where, you know, where is this spot. And that one's flipped all the way up and in the netting. We'll get a new face off. So, you know, they do their homework. Cool, so we'll get a big line change going here. We got Gracer. He was a birthday boy yesterday, 21 on the 21st, so tried to get him a goal last night. He was close on the one. Place would have probably won nuts. He's got a bunch of friends and family sitting up here right now. Badgett down there fighting with They flip it up and over and get it out of the zone. Brett's back to collect that one up. Had a couple of birthdays this week. Blair's birthday was on the 18th, so. Yep. Yeah, Joe had a Happy big birthday, goal. Bo. Yep. Happy birthday, boys. Let's go. Yeah, if you didn't hear last night because we didn't have much for audio and stuff like that. And Matt's got that all figured out tonight. He was here early. He got that taken care of. But last weekend, Joe had the first goal on the Friday night. At the, they had eight goals that night on Friday with eight different players. So a little payback to Hudson. And second night went overtime and a shootout for a win. So they took two from us, and we went down there and or up there and took two away from them. So... And as of as of this morning, the stats wise, he still had the Moose up by two. They're at 52. I think we're at 50, or is it 50? And it's two point difference right now between first and second. I think the third place teams at 38, 39. So I mean, they got a you know two horse race right now, pretty much. Yep, and getting getting them middle of the season, you know, the yep. second half of the season, get on a roll and get into the playoffs. So. Flip that puck back behind the net there. Kirch come back there trying to get his guy off and spun him right out. Ooh, big blast. And oh, <laughs> Brzezicki had it doorstop. He may not have got the handle on it quick enough, but Kirch back there for, ooh, there he got him again. Ooh, nice, nice spin move by Brzezicki. Flipped that down, tried to get Kirch up front. Yeah, they're fighting down in this end. They will not let him get out of here, and that's what they need to do. Yaku flips it down. Yeah, the Brzezicki one, I'm not sure if the goalie stuck his stick out and got a little piece of that. That just tried to get a, ooh, they had, Steer tried to get Karich up front, coming right down the crease, and, ooh, big chopper, ooh, oh, he sitting right, uh. oh, that, another one sitting right in front of the net. Ooh, Davis tried to get him, Steer right there, big blast from Yaku's up point. <laughs> the puck was sitting there. No whistle, so Kirich has come through and threw a shoulder in, a, in number 43. That's Samson. He's kind of looking like, where did that just come from? Twi <laughs> what, twi it's twice that puck has just been sitting in front of him. One time he had no idea it was there. He was standing yep. there, and it was about a foot in front of him. There's about four last night, if, if not more last night, that you're sitting here, and you can see the puck sitting there, and everybody's kind of looking around. And it's like it's, you, you almost want to yell, it's right there. But, you know, you get that much stick and skates and legs and everything else trying to see through that jungle. You know, we got a bird's eye view up here. It's real easy to see the puck. There, Rum River trying to, newcomer gets a stick on that one. They fight down to the corner. Defense is definitely doing their thing tonight. They're not letting anything, ooh, try to get newcomer on a breakaway there. Just hopped a stick, I think, a little bit, but. Tranquino back collects that one up. He's got Reese out here. Bizamente back here. Yeah, 51 was going to forecheck, but he was offside. He was, <laughs> ooh, bad turnover. Still fighting down there. Reese takes his guy. That's one of the biggest guys. That's a 6'2", 200 pounder there for Rum River, and Reese is nowhere close to that. Being a little, little pit bull bulldog <laughs> action, he's like, nope, he don't care. not going to be scared. <laughs> He, I have yet to see him back down from pretty much anybody, so a little one. Oh, beautiful save by Blackburn. Rum River at a breakaway coming right through the crease. Blackburn just snuffed him right out. So we are talking to yesterday, and those who didn't hear it, uh, interesting move by Marty. It was right at the shootout. They pulled Blackburn and put Riley Allen in. 
And then come to find out, Riley Allen has been lights out on shootouts during practices and everything else. So <laughs> it, it showed. He, he stuffed him. It was a strange move, but a, you know, not just a whim move. It's a well calculated move. You know, numbers don't lie. You know, you watch practice, and these guys, you know, don't play easy against their own teammates at practice. They play three on three, they go full out. So. I'm going to keep an eye on it. I saw Reese McDonald come off at one of the early shifts, and I don't think he's been back on the ice. I'm not sure. He didn't look right when he came off the ice, but he's sitting down here on the bench. Yeah. Right? But I haven't seen the trainer or anybody look at Uh-oh. Oh, Hogan lost his foot air. Blackburn come all the way out of the crease. He wasn't going to give him a free shot. Big shot. That one went high and wide. Oh. Ooh. Big tip, and that was a pull. Yeah, yeah, they're gonna call high it a high stick. stick. Yeah. Now, those who have watched this game and were here two weeks ago against Hudson, we had an sure. overtime win where that exact play happened. But I'm not gonna say it was right or wrong. But they called the whistle on this one. <laughs> Take that as way you will. I'll leave that one alone. That yeah, probably won't. But so we're gonna face off back down here in Rum Riverside. Hey, I can't pick an official. They're, they do their job out there and do the best they can every night. Oh, Steer tried to. Oh, there's a big takedown. There's another trip. <laughs> they can call. Was that a whistle? That's a whistle. That was okay. kind of a real quiet and. <laughs> yeah, Steer was basically took him down. And otherwise, he'd have been on a breakaway. So and that'd be a hook on Steer. So we'll get a little Rum River uh, power play with exactly two minutes to go in the period. Don't see that very often. <laughs> no, no. I see if we can come up with a shorthander, eh? You know, I was looking at the numbers this morning, and they're still putting a ton of numbers up for shorthanded goals. Almost got one last night. Pizzamente had a, I mean, he was a half a step off from breaking one out. And on a side note, touchdown Green Bay. <laughs> yes, for those of the Chicago fans, and then we have one up here, Mr. Zach over here on the camera, is not being happy right now. <laughs> oh, we'll get a little face off here. Oh, good timing of them to be when we're waiting and oh. stopping our action to do that. So. Oh, there you go. They must have changed. They put the two minutes on the clock. There's nine and a half minutes left of the of the period. I was wondering that, that was like the fastest period in history. <laughs> little ca clock malfunction. They're down there fighting for Yaku's down there. Fizmente gets in there, tries to get that puck out of there. Ooh, they centered it. And top shelf and beat Blackburn. He was screened all the way down. So like last night, Rum River scores first, but that was quick, 20 seconds. So we'll see what uh, kind of response this gets out of the Rapids. That's kind of the what it was yesterday. It took a goal to wake him up. After that, it was a barrage. <laughs> I'm kind of curious. There was a little bit of conversation with the the guy that Steer took down and Steer as he was going to the penalty box, and then I just saw somebody got under. Ooh. I'll let you talk play by play. Oh, you're good. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, just a big Brzezicki come through there and bounce one off the stick. Steers back there. He's got Davis catching up to him. They're going to see if they can get. And Blackburn got beat on another quick one. Okay, that's, just, the, just, that's the second breakaway. And not counting the one that Steer took the penalty on. Yeah. They're, giving, they're giving up some odd man rushes going the other way. That needs to stop. Yep. I mean, that was just, Steer tried everything he could do. He had no help back here for it. So Davis tried to catch up to it and couldn't get there fast enough. Oh, nine minutes to go. Two nothing game with four shots on goal. So now we need a little jump start. Yeah, a lot of hockey to play yet. Oh, they bring it down. Newcomer clicks that one back up, flips it out McDonald. Oh, good to see him back on the ice. Yep, so wherever it was, must have been just a, maybe a little extra wind or something. 
So we'll get going on face off here on the right side of the goalie out here and see if we can get a nice quick shot. At least get one before we get out of this period. I'd like to see it tied up before we get out of here. Yeah, power play was so quick I didn't even get a chance to go to their power <laughs> kill numbers or anything like that. And as they win the face and flips it up there, Yakuz kicks it back. That was almost dangerous too if you'd have... Ooh, tried to get a chip shot. Two of them. Both shots for Yakuz went center mass. He had a big rebound. But the angle he was at, the only shot he had was middle. So, I mean, he, at least he got it on goal. So Yeah, get the face off back. Win the offensive face off. We'll... Ooh, newcomer wide open. He looked like he was going to pull that trigger. Ooh, Reese tried to deflect it and got a little bit too much on it. See, they let him get a quick breakaway again. Mm -hmm. This time Blackburn snuffed that one out, but whatever Rum River sees about breakouts, they are getting them, you know, one after another. So they did some homework last night and saw something on the defense that, you know, they're not catching. And I guarantee you after this period that will probably be adjusted by Marty and Zach down there. Oh, I can guarantee you. <laughs> Newcomer down in the corner looking for someone to go with it. Gives it back up to Reese. He comes right, tries a little give and go and take down by Newcomer. He's looking around trying to see why, why nothing was called on that. Bring it center ice. Padgett collects that one up, dumps that down in there, gets the rest of the line change for Wisconsin Rapids. Davis down there trying to tie it up as long as he can, get the rest of that line change. Hey, flip it up. Oh, well, they almost got an offsides on that one, but enough sticks down there they couldn't see. We tried to put the brakes on there. He stopped, but the puck kept going around the corner. Get it up to Kirich. He's back there. Flips it back up to Brzezecki. Oh, quick little wrist shot by Davis. A little extra little pushing and shoving, but nothing hurt out of that one. Everybody's kind of greeting each other back there. Yeah, I mean, as far as Dodson back there, he's been, I mean, he's got 18 shots already, and we're not even, you know, seven minutes ago in the first period. Yeah, it feels, I mean, it feels, it does not feel like a 2 nothing game. I mean, no. River Kings dominated, and the River got the power, the quick power play, and then that quick breakaway, and they've had those two good scoring chances, and they've made them count, and got to come up with an answer here. Yep, something. Just to get, the, get get that momentum switch, you know that's a big thing, you know, right there. Win the face off, big high and wide, big rebound up in front. Steered the back there, kicking it around, trying to get something. Kirich back there, fighting for his guy. Oh, good hard work back there. Oh yeah, Davis down there tying his guy. Ooh, Brzezicki clicked that one back up, back over to Yakuz to steer. Ooh, flipped it in, a little floater. Kirich got a little stick on it, but. <laughs> <laughs> Extracurricular activities. <laughs> Little extra push and shove. But coach kind of tell him just get out, get back to hockey. That's Tristan over there for the Rum River coach here. He's kind of turned this program around. He picked up this year. I mean, we were talking about this a little bit last night too. Is you know they're in seventh place to 20 points. And <laughs> oh he got oh, he got checked into the goal. Yeah. And everybody kind of shoving. Kirich has got with his guy. He, ca yeah. he called a penalty, but he got checked into the goalie. Yeah, Brzezicki got completely shoved into him. And the goalie just kind of gave him a little pat going, yeah, I seen it. You know. Yeah, that's one of those calls he was looking right at it. Are they They're going to pull a couple of them. I know Brzezicki's going for Rapids. And they're going to put Kirich in there also. Well, they're going to put any. Yep, they're going to put. And Howell's going in for. <laughs> for Rum River. <laughs> so we got a box full of uh, culprits, and we'll see what happens after this. Yeah, I was kind of curious. He got completely, basically, cross checked from behind, plowed into the goalie. 
And then the melee started, which Karras was kind of backing his guy up. Yeah, I was going to try and listen in. When I took my headset off for a second. I was going to try and listen in to see what he's saying, but I can't hear it from up here. We'll just have well, to listen to whatever the rink announcer <laughs> tells us. We try to cheat as much as we can. We're only, you know, 15 feet above them, but they're talking through a little hole. Four on three, four on three. So two and two. Yeah. And two. Okay, so we're going to have two minutes on two of the River okay. Kings players, and Kirich and Brzecki, and two minutes on number 23 for the Rum River. That's Howell. Yeah. So we got the scoreboard all lit up with some pretty colors, and we'll go from there. That was pretty good. I think we ended up with what? Now you have to look here quick. Penalty wise, one, two, three, seven penalties last night, I think I got written down. And we've already hit, you know, four already. So, I mean, well, it is what it is. The River Kings cannot give up a power play goal here. Nope. They've got to kill us off. Which is surprising. They're four on three, and they're letting Steer just kind of walk around and. He's all by himself down here, but he's took a big hack at her, but hit the net, yeah. And we'll get an offensive faceoff. I mean, he just blew 23 seconds, you know, skating around in his zone, and nobody was down there to contest it. So, hey, we'll take it. Absolutely. A lot of, a lot of ice down here. You to pull a couple guys off, and it looks empty down here. <laughs> Rum River collects it. No, you didn't see this last night, Mark, but... Last night when they have a full five guy power play, they actually do the Hudson modified V. They did it a couple times too, where all five lined up. Then they kind of do a modified like a three on, you know, like a three two defense. <laughs> you know, so everybody has a little, uh, there Yaku's fires that one down. That was a nice a, block by, yep. I think it was Steer. Yeah, yeah, Steer had a nice block down there defensively. Yeah, he comes off for a little breather. He had a long skate there. Started out and Brett jumps in with McDonald and Yaku's back here and Reese gets a hack on that one. Keep chewing, the best. Yep. Keep chewing time. Yep, drop it down again. He's under 45 right now. A little pull check there from both people and he's still got the shot off, but that one collected up. That one's gonna roll all the way down. That's gonna burn a lot of time. That's a slow rolling puck right there. Pizmenti comes out with Padgett coming out to back him up. Still Brett's out there on his side. Ooh, Pizmenti stole the puck. He's kind of got a little one-on-one. -on -one. That was a big blocker save. Rides into the corner. It's only 22 seconds to go with this power play. Remember trying to bring it up. That one got sloppy and Padgett collects that. That should, that won't basically do it, but that's going to be real close to putting the end of that power play 10 seconds to go. Trying to bring it up center ice again. You pass the, it up the there. Pizz of any poke again. Yep, there it is, man. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's just they got that poke shack down. Pageant and Pizz of any. I mean, between the two of them, it's just, you know. Now that was probably the fastest power play. <laughs> yeah, no, no stoppages, no. No, nothing. Ooh, it was, we got a chance. Reese is down there, drops it back off the newcomer. He fired that, ooh, right bouncing in the middle again, and nobody. Could get a stick down fast enough. And Blackburn's just going to cover that one up with four minutes to go. Yeah, there's some big rebounds just kind of hanging up in front of the net there. And there's just not a guy there quick enough to, you know, clean the garbage up. So we'll get that first line back out there. Kirich, Davis, Brzecki, Yakus, and Steer out there right now. Yeah, that's a hurt, that's a hurt one. When you get two guys on the same line in the box together, you know, that's another one that doesn't fare well. Ooh, big wrist shot. Blackburn hit that one. Ooh, that one scooted by. Kirich on a breakaway flips it back to Davis. Backhand. Oh, Kirich just missed it. He had him right there. Ooh, Davis, good hustle on that one. Kept it in. Brzecki with a little kick. Oh, he shot wide. Yakus picks that up, flips he, over to Steer. Oh, fired that one in. It's just, it, it's that six inch game again. Oh, they tried to clear the zone to I flip was, it. And 
I was waiting for Yankus to get his tee off on one, and he couldn't get the puck to settle down, so he <laughs> passed it over, and he still got a good scoring yep. chance out of it. Ooh, Davis with a high shot. He's got a stick on that one. Yeah, that hit high up on the stick. That's a different sound. That one's floating right, right in the middle of the <laughs> crease again. There's the Aquas fire. No one off somebody's stick. This looks like the River Kings are on a power play right now. This is kind of the the look we had last night. And there they finally cleared the zone. Rome River bringing it down. He's got one guy tailing him, but they're going to get a quick line change, a quick shot on Blackburn. Steer back there. Bring that one up. He turns around. Brings that one over Yakuz, flips it back. Ooh, that was kind of a dangerous little pass from Yakuz. That didn't go where he wanted it to. No. Blackburn back there kind of got the stick down just enough. Hogan and Grano fighting for every inch of property they can get. Ooh, Grano with a nice block, kips that in back behind the net. Hogan trying to keep it back in there and Everybody kind of fighting for real estate right now. Flip from River gets that backed up. Padgett down there trying to catch up to a quick. Marty didn't wait to make his adjustment until they got. Ooh, oh, Padgett nice. laid right out on that one. Took every angle away from him on that one. I mean, that was a, he was about point blank on that one. And Padgett did what he could and just laid out. Hogan collects that one up, gets that back out of center ice. Get a line change with a couple guys anyways. Fizbenti and Siciliano collects that one back up, brings that one back around. Padgett looking for he Got Pizmenti, ooh, Pizmenti tried to catch up to it and bounced off his stick on that one. Ooh, McDonald and Yakuz converge on the puck. Yakuz takes that, flip him, flips that back up. Howell cuts that one off, and then they got to, yeah. He was about, he was about yeah. four feet. I mean, he was close. Yeah, he was I in mean, the ballpark. He's got to do that 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 stretch deal that <laughs> tall guys do. He had to, I mean, he had to have been full splits, and I still don't think he'd have made her. No. Yeah, Howell smelled blood on that one. He come down the corner with the head of steam. <laughs> if he if he'd do the splits like that, he could probably play goalie. <laughs> That Pizzamendi and his guy has a Hershide back here. They were about a foot away from that puck drop before when they did it. I'm surprised the linesman or somebody didn't whistle him off, but <laughs> that one bounced right out. <laughs> steer, Almost. <laughs> just about killed poor Reese McDonald. The steer fired it down. Reese kind of jumped back for a second. Kind of gave Steer a little look like. That would have been the painful, <laughs> most painful offsides ever. Uh, a minute to go. Right now, it's a battle of blue lines. They can't figure out which side they want to go. And we're going to call offsides. I don't know how you can yeah, tell. Look, <laughs> looks like it. Yeah. Well, 49 seconds to go here. We're going to. Oh, we're going to go all the way down. I'm not sure what did they flip did somebody flip it up into the netting or something? It looked like they were just fighting for come across the blue line there, but we're all the way down to Rum River's end, so whatever the call is, we'll take it down this end. Rum River clicks that back up. He's back behind the net. Ooh, that one I think that one bounced off of Kirch's helmet. It did hit somebody's helmet. Oh there. Oh, they're gonna call <laughs> Oh, well, that one he got tripped. See, he's just laying in front of the goalie. Otherwise, he may have like, crushed him again. I was looking for a hand in the air to see <laughs> if they would call something because they took yeah. his feet right out from underneath yeah. him. <laughs> yeah, and those who don't know, I'll give a shout out to Matt Hall's family. He said he was a he was our little uh, roommate for about six months. So you guys listening down there, we definitely say hi. Me and the family. We like to give Matt a hard time every time he's up here, and so do the guys. A bunch of the guys still know him from last year, so. There's a big hit from Berzecki, laid out. Ooh, big tip. Fight down here to the corner with 25 seconds to go. Well, everybody's got to get back, otherwise that would have been offsides. Kierich back there. Davis back there fighting with him. Steer, here comes Pizzamene. Ooh, Davis with a beautiful stop. Ooh, Steer had him point. Ooh, there's another tip. Right in front of the net, just the puck's just bouncing in front of the net, and they just cannot find a way to get one in there. There's another save, and that'll be the end of the first. I mean, Dotson, shots. <laughs> Dotson has got a rabbit foot in his pocket right now and using every bit of it. So at the end of one, we got a 2 nothing Rum River right now. 
We'll make some adjustments. We'll be back in 17 minutes. Let poor Zach over here know that the Packers are still winning. So And they just got an interception. There we go. So or a fumble recovery. <laughs> All right, we'll be back in 17 minutes. All right. All right, we're back with period two of River King Hockey. Hopefully a little different outcome than period one. Rum River leading two nothing right now, but look at shots on goal. We got 26 to seven. So a little adjustment, Mark, a little uh, pep talk and see what we can do. Well, with out rubbing on the ice, you need somebody to come up with your spark plug. You need somebody, you need one of your leaders on your team, one of your captains to come up and step up and. I mean, there's plenty of, I mean, plenty of hockey left. Yeah. So, not that, like we always talk, not hit that panic button soon, but it wouldn't be a bad time to, you know, at least even this up, get at least one goal, you yeah. know, and make this a little more achievable. And what's killing them is they're letting that breakaway go. So, as long as they eliminate those, then we won't, you know, so there right. we go. Yeah, like you said, they made those adjustments even mid midstream because they after that breakaway goal, they didn't let, I, there was not any other breakaways that were clean, no, nothing clean anyway. Ooh, right point blank. And Dotson, well, I mean, he's having a game. Dotson right there again. They were point blank with Kirich right there, and he covered it right up. So that was a pretty play. Davis was moving, you know, moving laterally and must have heard him call out for it, and he just kind of made a no look yep. pass back to him, but he was unable to find an opening. So they're starting to barrage early. So quick shot on goal. They're just going to keep pumping them in. They're going to find a hole eventually. They just keep fighting for every inch right now. I mean, they're fighting for, you know, keep that puck down the end, and they just keep keep going and keep going. Ooh, another point blank again. Just missed his pass. I think he was trying to hit Davis or Kirich up front there. And ooh, they give it up, and big pile up down there. Everybody was trying to scramble, and new ice, they slide all the way down. <laughs> Bolton kind of hung on for it. Ooh, pass up to Yakus. It, Bounce it up. <laughs> Kirich was on the on the ground and took a hack at her and couldn't get enough on it. That one get flipped up there. So they'll get a new face off. Big line change for everybody right off the bat. It's throwing me off with Yakus and that fishbowl on there. Just every time I look down there, I don't think it's him. I don't know. It's just something simple, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and we got. Presidente McDonald, newcomer, Yakus and Steer out there for this face-off. And they try to bow. Yakus kept that in. He fires a cool. That took a wicked hop off his stick, caught him in the face mask or under the face mask. So I mean he's not keeping everything tight, so it's not a hard, you know, you know, try to get a rebound there. Their chances there, we're just not collecting up on them. Yeah, when, when there have been pucks there, haven't had anybody around. <laughs> yeah, we're looking up here just cringing because we're all seeing it from our angles. Like the puck is right there. <laughs> but with, you know, 10 guys, you know, in a small area, sticks and skates and everything else, yeah, they try to pick that puck out. You know, sometimes. And they're trying well, to clear that, that out. Not just that, but we don't have anybody trying to take our head off either. Yeah. Ooh, they had a... Point blank, there's another oh, one just. Nice save. Blackburn saved it and it just stalled right on the crease. Yaku's coming up. He's got help behind him with Newcomer, just missed the pass on that one. Reese keeps that one back in. Yeah, everybody on the bench on that one was just holding their breath for a second. Steer got his guy and he backs off for a second, wait for help. They fire that one and Blackburn collects that one up in the middle. It's always fun when they go down like that and they know they, they hit it, so they have no idea where the puck is on them. <laughs> Sometimes it's down the pad, it could be up in the glove, under the armpit. All they know is they didn't hear a whistle and the and the little light behind them isn't flashing. That's all they care. <laughs> so we're going to quick face off here. Life's simple when you put it that way, isn't it? <laughs> Just, you know, it's a simple game <laughs> with a lot of, a lot of confusion in between. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just take the puck, put it in the net, you know. And five other guys with sticks hacking at you. I mean, it's it. <laughs> Grano down there fighting, keeping that puck down in the end. Rum River came out of it, and Grano turned right back around. And it's like I really wanted that puck, and I'm—he's still going after that thing. When, 
Ooh, almost rifled the headlinesman. <laughs> Patrick collects that one out. That was almost a little foot race back here. Flips it up. O'Neal back there and Grano back there. Ooh, Rummer. Ooh, nice little. Grano, a little poke check. One right between the legs of the defenseman. Gracer chasing down here in the corner, keeping up with the puck. Trying to keep that one in the zone. They collect it up. Pass back behind the net. Gracer, you know, they try to get center pass. They got a little two on two there. Mitchell King back there. Big blast, went high and wide. And Blackburn throws his arm up there to try to block it. Here, four car pile up in the front of the Mallards bench here. I think, I think Blair got the blunt end of Mitchell King's little check there. Remember, cut that one back up. Get something going. Ooh, he lost the puck down the corner. They're back, still fighting. They can't get out from behind the net there. And... Oh. Yeah, one of the uh, Rum River guys checked. <laughs> kind of took the net off the moorings there. <laughs> <laughs> one of the, right into the, yeah. <laughs> Wasn't sure at first, because that didn't look any different than when they checked Brzecki into the goalie down here. <laughs> yeah, they whistled him for that one, but. <laughs> Not sure Adam's back was to me. He may have asked, you know, what was that different? But all innocent. Ooh, he flipped down right center. Point blank again. Kira tried to get a shot off. That was between a couple defenders. They cleared out. Yaku's clipped that one in there. He's looking for a shot. You know, from my angle right there, he hit center mass, and there is a big gap five hole. There was a big gap five hole, and there was also a, a River King stick to the right of the goal. If he can shoot that off and get a deflection. I mean, we're armchair quarterbacking up here so bad, but <laughs> you know we have the we have that perfect angle and the perfect look. So I mean, it don't take much for us to just you know. Why didn't he see that? Remember, trying to get it out of the zone. They tried to Ooh. catch a breakaway on that they one. They were behind the defense again. Yep. Ooh, Davis got a little spin move. Kirich right there in the corner. Center mass again. They're, they're staying up high. And they're just hitting him right dead center logo. That one looked like it maybe was a little bit to the right. From I mean, we've got it had a good angle on that shot. Where it, but it's hitting the pad. You can hear it when it hits him. It's not yep. going into his sweater or anything like that. It's... Yep. Hitting his chest pad. Ooh, River Kings came out of there with that. His <laughs> Mente and McDonald back there collecting up. Newcomer chasing around the corner. Steer collects it in the point, fires one in. Ooh, his Mente had a tip and just went wide. Blocker side, but. And they flipped that one up. They kind of got a little. Not much of a breakaway, but they're looking. He fires it in. A little chip shot, and Blackburn just grabs that with the glove and stops out of the action for a second. So we're still at, I mean, we're at 31 shots to nine. So it is they, not the lack of trying. That one. <laughs> well, technically it was an increase. He caught it. We'll give him it. I mean, not that it helps Rum River, but it does help Blackburn with that, you know, goal per average. So we'll get a face off. Reese gets that one. Rum River collects it up. They fire it down around the net. Right down there collects it. That was almost a little, kind of squirted up in front of Blackburn there, but. Ooh, just in front of Reese on that one. And they chip that one down in the zone. Brick goes back, clicks that one up. Ooh, he was gonna flip it around the corner, but well, the Rum River guys was sitting back there. And, and we get a whistle high for a high stick. Is that playing the puck or is it, a, he's, he's calling a penalty, isn't he? Yeah, we're gonna get Brett for a, I missed it completely. He he kind of did a pirouette behind the net when he spun. The the Rum River player kind of skated in front of him, and I think it's it was totally inadvertent. He didn't even know the guy was there, and it looked like that his stick maybe just barely made contact with his helmet. So if that's what he's calling, I mean it's got to be what he's calling. I, yeah. Without the benefit of replay, it was really ticky tack. Yeah, Marty wanted a little Four explanation. minutes. Wow. I, I guess oh, I completely missed a four minute. I mean, that's almost take a guy's head off for f four minutes, but. What? In Apparently, there was more to it than 
meets the eye. Yeah, we'll make it. Well, okay. let's see if the hockey gods can smile on the river. Oh, We're right up in the front. Oh, Pismen oh, just yes. got enough of it. And we're going to get a little. They're going to. They're, who are they calling that on? They're calling that on. That guy was sitting in the crease, and Blackburn gave him a shove. And Steer's trying the, to figure out what he got called for too. When the puck was out, the puck was out of the zone, and that guy is sitting in the crease, and Blackburn gave him a shove, and they. And they're going to get Steer for rough. Marty's trying to get a little explanation right now. He's probably asking the same thing. How is the puck out of the zone, and he gets called for that? So now we're going to have five on three for at least two minutes. Well, time to tighten the skates up it a little will, harder. It will, be, it will be for two minutes yeah. because they're going to kill this off. They have to. Now let's just play smart. That's just a melee. I know Reese got a glove up just to try to get that out of the front. Couldn't get enough on it to get it out of the zone. Nope. They keep looking, keep passing around. They're trying to find an angle and big blocker there. That one went deflected back. Get Ooh. that out of there. Badger got a little stick in there. there Reese go. got a hold of it. Oh, oh yeah, just, just got enough. it out. Not enough to get a line change in. But nope. Nope, but they got at least enough that it uh, makes everybody clear out for at least a couple seconds. Padgett out there in the corner with Reese and Yaku's down center. They're just going to keep flipping the puck around. Blackburn's trying to keep an eye on every movement. Nice blocker, blocker save there. Reese trying to get that out of there. He's fighting. That guy's holding his hold stick. The stick. Yeah. yeah. There. There you go. Nice job. There, Yakus is going to at least get over here. Siciliano gets out there. Get one set of her legs anyway. Yep. Reese stayed out there, and so did Padgett. Ooh, Reese got caught kind of flat footed out yeah. at center ice there. He got back quick enough. He collected himself. He went for the pick. And, ooh, Padgett with a nice move there. He took every angle away. Got back up quick. That one shot wide right. 30 seconds left of the first penalty. Two two minutes left on the, on the Yakus one. Or no, I mean Brett one. Sorry, my bad. 20 seconds left. They're going to still kill. There's a kick that one off to the side by Blackburn. They're still going. I mean, they... You Keep got two looking. tired River Kings out there. Yep. Oh, there you go. Blackburn covered that one up good. Yep. That'll now give him a time a line to switch. Change. Yeah. Get switch. some legs out there. Yeah, Padgett and, and McDonald out there both just cranking for the last two minutes and seven seconds left of the first penalty. So we got Siciliano, Pizzamente, and Yakus out there for three guys sitting now. They bring her out the point. They're trying to move a little floater. Oh. This man, he almost went for it there. And there he's going to take his guy off the puck. They're fighting for it now. They're going to at least get it out of the zone there. Oh, no, not yet. It's oh still floating gosh. around. Ooh, Blackburn collected that one. He's not sure where it's at, but he ain't leaving it. <laughs> he, he crunched up in the ball like <laughs> it didn't go in, and I'm not letting it. I'm sorry, that puck, when it's sitting, I mean, that was one inch on the blue line. I mean, you got to get that one out of the zone yep. and make them reset. You can't so we, cough that one up. So we got five on four right now. Brzecki, Fizzamenti, Yakus, and Steer out there. A minute 26 left on Brett's penalty. All that stuff is easy to say when you're sitting up here in the, in, in the <laughs> I booth. Can, I can armchair like nobody's <laughs> business from here. I'm telling you that. <laughs> You know, I give the guys a hard time. You know, we, we run into them, and a couple of us up here got players at home, and we can, you know, ask them questions in armchair all we want. But, you know, you see how you get down by the ice oh. level here and see how fast these guys skate, how fast that puck sails around. It, <laughs> it is not an easy sport. They're fighting around in there. There we go. Steer picks that one up. Ooh, just got a little hop on that one. Ooh, Pizzamente, they will collect that one up. 45 seconds to go. They're going to tie it up on Rum River's end here for a little bit. Pizzamente still fighting with this guy back there. 
That shoots some time up. They fire that one all the way around. That should be that icing. should be. Boy, that's another one. They did that last night. When you're on a power play and you fire the puck down and get an icing with a guy advantage. Not sure the thinking on that one. I don't know if they were just frustrated that they couldn't get it out of the zone and fired it down, but now it's going to stay in the zone. 30 seconds left, 32 seconds left. Yakuz, Padgett, McDonald, and Newcomer out there now. That helped that. They'll get a new fresh set of legs. Ooh, newcomer got a little stick on that one after Reese collected it. They're waiting for Reese down there. Just take his guy right check. off the puck. <laughs> just takes his guy right off the puck and just killed about another 10, 15 seconds. See, it's kind of a modified V. They kind of yeah, that was almost an inverse V. Ooh, Yaku's took that one in the shin guard. Didn't know where it was, but he made sure his guy got off the puck, and that will kill that power play. So very well needed uh, kill yep. on that one. Yep. Now let's. Now you got to regroup and take care. You got to see if you can get some offensive pressure going. Yep. There's about three guys that tried to get a stick on that one to get out of there, and she still bounced all the way to Blackburn. He just covered it up. Take a little fiver. That was that was fluttering in the air, and then it was bouncing weird on the ice. It would never never settle down either in the air or on the ice. <laughs> we had a couple get them a couple weird bounces once in a while. I could, we could use a you know weird bounce into a net on the other side right now. We picked that up. Carriage is on a. <laughs> that was a brace for impact down there in the corner between Howell and Kirich. They both kind of eyeballing each other. And that one deflected up from Brett. That one's way up in the rafters and up it, into the seats. <laughs> I was going to say, it never, that never came down. <laughs> Clean the dust off a rafter. Yeah. Well, a couple of weeks ago, they knocked a rubber ball, a, a super ball, super out, ball. Of the, out of the rafters that was stuck up there some way. Yeah, I look up here, and right on the next one over, I see two pucks sitting up there right now. So, eh. we'll get a quick face off here. River Kings clicked that one up. Dumps that down. Yaku's back in the point. Flips it over to Steer. Walking that line, he dumps it down, Kirich down the middle. Ooh, I think he missed a puck on that one. Remember, we collected that one back up. It steers over there, keep that one in the zone. Yaku's in the center, that one bounced up and up. Oh, shot. post. Crossbar. The deadly sin sound of a hockey player. Steer taking his guy, yeah. These, very hard to uh, beat Steer on a one on one. Davis tried to come in with that one. Got collected up. Oh, he's gonna try it again. And he lost the buck again. Yep. Ooh. Got a shot off though. Steer hit the puck out, guy collected back up, got a little wrist shot in at Blackburn. Ten minutes ago. We gotta get some action going here. That's halftime right there. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> that's a that's a that's an old badger trick right there. Ten minutes ago in the second period, everybody yells halftime for those who <laughs> everybody's been to a badger game. It's the funniest thing you ever want to hear. So <laughs> Ooh, they had Hogan oh there's a I guess they're not Hogan they had a handful of jersey on him, but he was on a breakaway and if they went to held on to him, he was gone. They're they are swallowing, just yep. mm, swallowing their way. There yeah. they get the makeup call. Yeah, that was the makeup. Now <laughs> you got to take care. Of, you got to take care of business on this power play yeah. right here. Yeah, I would never say there's ever makeup calls, but I'm gonna go with that was a big one because they had a handful of Hogan jersey down here. He was about blue line, about ready to turn the Jets on, and I mean when the guy's shoulders spin all the way sideways, and that. Yeah, and that was a, it was a trip, but it was probably one of the weaker trip calls I think you're going to probably see. Oh, I mean, right there, Reese probably just got, you know, and then they're giving a little breakaway here from Rum River. And they're, between Yakus and Steer, they kind of snuffed that one out quicker than what it should have happened, but there, Reese is coming in with Newcomer. He drops off Pizzamente, and it, oh, there was a nice little break from Steer. Ooh, Get big it. deflection. Oh. Just went right, wide right by Reese McDonald. Another point blank. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There's Big Jordy with the goal. 
That was well needed. 9-16 to go in the second. Now we got a 2-1 game. That's, that step, one. that's step one in the business to be done. <laughs> They're going to give that to Reese. Jordy say that was Reese on that one. I think he got a deflection. We give Jordy with an assist. Which, that puts him up on top of the boards right now. I mean, what, that's 34 for him now. So, we had a three-way tie, and he broke that for it. That guy is like the assist king right now. I think, was that, 26, 27? 26. Yeah. I did my homework today when I was, you know. <laughs> kind of looking up some numbers on these guys, looking at both teams. and Yeah, Pizzamenti's got 17 goals and six. Oh. Blackburn just got completely spun around. I had no idea where the puck was. He gave one and he gave it right back. It's not helping matters. Well, you got Pizzamenti for the River Kings. He's got 17 goals and 16 assists, and then steers. Well, who did they give that goal to? That was Reese. Okay, so Steers got eight goals and 25 assists. Redmond's got eight goals and 20, or well, 26 assists for Steer now. Eight. Redmond's got eight and 25, and you said Reese got the goal. Oh, we're going to switch out goalies. Riley Allen's going in right now. So with uh, nine minutes to go, they're going to switch out Blackburn and put Riley Allen in for the remainder of the game. No, after that last one, yeah, that last one was not. Probably, yeah, they're giving Riley a few minutes to kind of get a little warm up here. Yeah. Stretch out a little bit. Feel sorry for Blackburn because they, yeah. I mean, when you put 34 shots on the goal on goal on the other side and you don't have any, yeah, you don't have any uh, thing to show for it. Exactly. Well, now you got one. Didn't take nothing from Blackburn. He played a game up in Hudson like no other. I mean, he he had I don't know how many say 30, 40 saves up there. Won in overtime with that one. They bring that one around. They're gonna. Now we'll get it. Yeah, hit the post the first time. Actually, I think that first right one. Back out. I think the first one actually went in an inside corner, bounced straight back out. Need to. I thought I thought the same thing, but I heard it hit post, <laughs> and it came right straight back out. So it, might, it must never cross the line. So we'll see we'll have to have our video expert look <laughs> at it when he gets home, Mark. Look at it with the goal camera and see what, if that yeah. one went in or not. We don't have the luxury of replay. One day. <laughs> We'd be more concerned. We'd be watching more replays than live <laughs> action and trying to see what all happened. Ooh, another big quick shot there by Davis. It'd be a nice quick tie this thing up real quick. Oh, that one was loose. Oh. It was it was loose. Still right loose. The pot. <laughs> Still loose down in there. Well, we'll get the face off, offensive zone face off here yep. anyway. He's assisted by number 27. See if Marty's drawing up, making a quick switch here again, and <laughs> there's another assist for Jordy. <laughs> Just keeps racking him up. Well, there's a reason he's the assist leader, huh? Yeah. Was he, he's over 200 now, isn't he? Oh, yeah. He just keeps putting more under that record than what he had. And, ooh, quick shot by oh. Hogan. Ooh. Grano was right in front of the net. Tried to get a hack at her and just didn't qu quite get enough. That one fired down there. Is that Armillo down there right now giving every bit of <laughs> big collision between Grano and all four guys down there. They're just working it. Just. Got a little momentum going right now, and Hogan with a little backhand. I think that hit side of the net. Grano back there flipped that up. Ooh, Amillo kept that one in. <laughs> a little pirouette, spin around, and they're just firing it. Ooh, that one kept in. Ooh, nice little tip pass to Grano from Yakus. And he kicked that one out. Ooh, I thought that one was going to make the net, but it never got far enough. Ooh, tried to get up close with that one. That one's going to fire it on. Not hard enough for nope. icing, but... They're going to get a line change. They were getting, the Rum River was getting tired. They Yeah, they kept them down that zone for quite a while. Oh. Yeah, and that one's going to go. 
Oh, they're going to wave that one off just because. Oh. Wow. They are both digging for that one. I thought he was going to wave it off, but they're going to get icing on that one and bring that one this down. This guy is not making any friends in Wisconsin <laughs> Rapids, I can tell you that. No, no, not for sure. And guys, I mean, newcomer kind of looked at him, kind of looked over his shoulder and kind of just kind of gave him a little head shake, like whatever. You know, you can argue point all day long with the guys in stripes, but I have yet to see anybody ever win one of those arguments. No. I'm guilty usually, of it. <laughs> usually you end up in, you know, well, in this game, the penalty box. Uh, <laughs> yeah. In I, football, you lose yardage or get kicked out of the game. Baseball, uh, you get ejected. It just <laughs> doesn't seem to work out all that great. No, no, and, you know, and I'm guilty of it, and I think there's a few other coaches and players out there, too, that, you know, just human nature, you just got to argue the point once no, in a while. That one he waves off. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm going to have to go back to the rule book here and <laughs> kind of look at that one because the other one, they were on a dead heat, but anyway, well, they're the back The River then. Kings are just swarming. They, they've got that smell of blood right there. Oh, oh there was kind of two high sticks in a row. And, you know, Reese hit it the first time. Rome River hit it. So that cleared Reese of it, but then it, Rome River hit a high stick, and then kind of kind of goes back and forth between the two. Ooh, kept that one in the zone. Ooh, Davis picks that up. He's looking. Big hard shot, but set right front and center. Oh, Kirch is looking for a little backhand to Yakus, and Rome River just got a stick on it to hold it up. Ooh, big fight. Oh, Ooh. he took. Yeah, Jordy took that one in the knee. Uh -huh. He's mad at that one. I. Eh? He missed a couple games with a bruised knee for a while. He's, uh, he's yeah, trying to get off the ice. Trying to get off the ice, and he's got to stay back. Oh, and he, he laid yeah, out he, for that. that I is, tell you what, he it, gets a star of the game for that. Yeah, he's trying to get back. He's getting uh -oh. a maker. Uh oh, we got a problem. Yep, Pageant and Cicely Allen just racing right now. Pageant laid out. Oh, and the guy fanned on the dead center. Another big melee in front. Oh, good Cisliano. job, Cicliano cleared it. Yep, he scarfed that puck up and just get it out of the zone. Let's Davis collects it up. He's got Kirich out here. Kirich had a little breakaway and got taken off his puck here. They're going to try to get a little another little breakaway and try to catch River Kings on a little line change and almost did. That one sails high and wide. Cicliano down there fighting for his guy. Keeps it in there. Armillo down there, Grano down there, and Rome River came out of it. Nice oh, no, blocker I, there. Oh, man. what are they calling? They're going to get either a slash. slash. Yeah. He got him. I, I give him this penalty, and Grano knows it too. He got him, and he. But he saved. He may have saved a goal. If that yeah. guy gets. If he lets him go in clean on the goal. Yeah. Then Jordy's right back out. <laughs> To me, I'll put I'll put that in there. I spent uh, most of my day at a basketball tournament watching my seventh grader play basketball. I'll take that with a kid going in for a layup, and you just lay your arm. Yep. Lay your you hammer across both arms and don't let him get the shot off. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, nice block there. Good I clear. Did, I think that was a Yakus and Pizmendi cleared that one all the way down. Yeah, maybe they just figured you know as as much as they've been killing the penalties tonight, they just take their chances. I mean, they blew 20 seconds already, quickly. Rome River with the head of steam. And oh! No. Wow, they're going to call what? that. They're going to call interference on Yakuza. Took his guy off the puck. And they're going to call interference. So they are determined to leave it a 5-3. If we get one, we're going to get two. I've seen that play a hundred times, and I've <laughs> never seen a penalty called on it. No. Nope. And that cleared all the way down. So we got Paget, Steer, and McDonald out there trying to kill at least a minute 20 left of the first penalty. They're talking to each other, setting things up. Yeah. Paget, oh, Paget just kind of looks like any moment he's just going to lay right out, and there was a... Kind of a slap shot, didn't get much on that one, but. Well, Jordy went. 
They cleared that one up. Padgett tried to clear it out and didn't get much on the stick on that one. Ooh, Ooh, Reese got, got a stick check. on that one in there. Ooh, another one there. Steer almost got a hold of that one. Jordy doesn't look quite right. He uh, just looks a little <laughs> awkward. There, Reese laid yeah. down. Had one knee down, ready to take an impact. Covered the face and turned the hip. They just close in, close in. They fired high and wide. 35 seconds to go left on this penalty on the first one. A minute to go on that there one. That go. one, Padgett got a yep. stick on that one, tipped that one out. Oh, that's Jordy's yeah. checking, checking his knee pad. I thought yeah. something didn't look right on him. So yeah, he... yeah we're not sure if Pad slid down when he took that shot, or is just not feeling right, or something. But they're going to get him, give him a well-needed break. Just Leonel McDonald and Brett out there right now. 31 seconds of the first, 58 on the second one. Brett collects that up. We tried to get something on there and didn't get enough to clear it. Brown River collecting it up. That one didn't make it through. That one took Sis Leano. I think Brett got a hold of that one too a little bit. Couldn't get it out of the zone though. 17 seconds to go on that one. That one went high and wide. That one still, they don't get enough on it to get it out of the zone. Eight seconds left of the first one. Brano down here looking. Oh, just wide. So two seconds, that's gonna about get rid of the first penalty. Here comes Pizzamente come crashing in, give the guys a little breather. Big scrap down the front there. Reese got taken down. They call that ticky tag stuff and Rum River is knocking, yeah. knocking guys to the ice. Got a cross check on Reese right in front of the net. And no hand in the air. Two and a half to go in the second. Get a full line change out here. This many, we need one more. Newcomers coming out. Paget, steer back out there again. That guy is just a robot. <laughs> <laughs> the guy just has no quit. I mean, he come off the ice limping. Two minute shift, back out there, you know. Probably in pain, but still giving her. Oh, he got a chance. Oh, oh, they couldn't get a bounce there. They needed a bounce. Pizzamente down there, just fighting there. Ooh, Jordy hit Newcomer. He's got Pizzamente off on the wing with him. He's looking right now. Fired it in there. Okay, get back there. to even strength. Get yep. the offensive zone face off. See if you can't knot this one up. You know, Newcomer is kind of killing time. He didn't want to go barreling in there. He's looking for a window. Seeing if he get Pizzamente on that far wing to try to get, you know, some kind of a, you know, shot off, but. We interrupt this message for a uh, Packers <laughs> update. Kent San Francisco had the uh, ball, ooh, first and goal, and the Packers just got a turnover. Oh, right oh. off of the, like, bottom part of the pad. Kind of almost just looked like he just kind of flipped it with his foot. Ooh, like a newcomer right down the middle. Ooh, loose puck. And Jordy just threw his head up and just could not believe he just missed a point blank shot with a minute 44 to go. <laughs> so we'll get a quick line change. I mean, they haven't stopped 44 shots on goal. And we're still, you know, minute 45 in the second. So I mean, they, they are definitely testing goalie. <laughs> I mean, you got Dotson back there, I mean, that's that's a lot of shots yeah. <laughs> for any team. Well, and the life, the, the the life, the life to bring back into the team. I mean, the fight back. He gave up that quick one after he had got that power play goal. Yeah. He and you go down three to yeah. one, and there's some teams that would, uh, that would just demoralize, and they came back with that other goal, and they've had yep. some good scoring chances. Killed off those two huge penalties. Yep. When you're killing, I mean, that's twice tonight they've been on five on three. You normally don't see that one, you know, maybe, no, you don't even see that once in a game, and we've already had it twice. Yeah. Oh, that one fired in there. No one knew where that puck actually ended up. That one come around. Yaku's clicked that one up. Oh. Ooh, tried to get it in front of her. Ooh, Davis got a stick on that one, deflected that one out. That one come around, blocker saved by Allen. That one's still up front. Ooh, Point blank strange. range. Riley with the big stop, minute 13 to go. 
Oh, you missed it. We had a stoppage before for the hand toss. I ain't got to say that one all night. <laughs> Sponsored by Polito's Pizza. <laughs> Yeah, you mess up one time and you kind of hang on to it. You own that one. <laughs> I'll take that one and run with it. <laughs> so we'll get a face off here. Stick side of Allen. Reese come out. Remember, collects that up, fires it in. Big. Oh. <laughs> Heard the air leave the building on that one. <laughs> that might have been me. <laughs> Fox sitting down here in blue line. Oh, yeah. Newcomer was in the zone before the puck, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Reese was pleading his case on that one. That was, there was so much going on in one spot. Linesman called him off right then and just said, no. Yeah, I think he had to skate over. I don't think so, but we'll leave it. Get a face off just outside. Reese with a big, he, he took that almost like a slap shot and dropped it right down to the zone. Newcomer takes his guy into there. McDonald back in the corner again. Ooh, he's got Pizzamente dead center. Hit him center mass again. <laughs> Newcomer and number 74, that's Stoner down there greeting each other, making sure they're all good to go. See how the family's doing. Trying to find the puck, was stuck down in the pad. Of Donaldson back there, Dodson. There are phase off. Reed get that one. They're back in the corner. Pizzamenti takes his guy off the puck. Back out to Newcomer. Flips it out. Steer dead center. Oh, that that combination right there. Pizzamenti flipped it over to Steer. And it was like a wide open Newcomer off in the corner to tie this game with 36 seconds to go. I mean, there you, go. Uh, <laughs> you, could have, you couldn't have drawn that up any better than that one. That is sweet. Then you got Steer. We're just going to let him run with the points, Lee, because, I mean, that's that's three assists for him tonight. He's gone. <laughs> I mean, those are the ones you drop on a chalkboard. <laughs> Sorry, the Packers just got an interception at the goal line, and they're already on the San Francisco 14-yard line with uh, 24 seconds left in the period. So, so I'm kind of watching two games here. <laughs> That's good. To. I'll keep my eyes on this one. You keep your eyes on that one. <laughs> I'm liking the results of both right now. So now we just got – we're going to come with 24 seconds to go. we got a brand-new game and a tight 3-3. You kind of feel that little momentum switch kind of going off right now. You know, takes one that, takes one thing to ignite the fire. Yeah, they just don't give up a cheap one here. Yep. Oh, Yaku's took his guy off. And, oh, nice. Oh, Davis had a chip shot there 10 seconds ago. Ooh. Oh, Yaku's with a big hit right in front of us, and he's going to get... Then he gets another guy hits him. Kirich is back there taking care of him. Kirich and Stoner taking care of each other. Kind of, a, kind of right in front of us yet. John Agee right down. I think that's Agee right down in front of us right now checking on the Ron Merver guy that's down. Yeah, I think he kind of went into the post there a little bit. Kind of see who that is. I can't see a number. It's Five, number five, five is down. That's Tyler Schmidt. Looks like he's getting up. They're going to help him up off the ice. Are they going to call anything out of this? Doesn't look like it. Well, I don't see the boxes open. Yeah, I think they're going to come over and they're going to let him go to the locker room early the with 10 seconds to go. Yeah, the hit was clean, but. Yeah, it just looked like he piled right, it was right he, down in front of us. Caught, kinda, yeah, he caught the post there right by the um, the penalty box. Yeah. You know, we've seen, you see it, and I mean, none of these guys are out here trying to hurt anybody or get hurt, but. You know, they just kind of. This game has been physical. I mean, oh yeah. the scrum behind the net and the scrum right down here in front of us. Yep. They come to play. Yeah, I mean, seven seconds, Ooh. Yaku just flips that out. Ooh. And that two, quick shot by Newcomer, and that'll end the period. 
as the newcomer got spun down. I don't know if that was incidental or accidental. They kind of, but everybody kind of piled up. So at the end of two, we're back to tie game. Back to even. 48-23. Yep. So <laughs> 20, second, minute, 20 minute hockey yeah. game. <laughs> so uh, between second and third period, Mark, I'm going to give you the option. You got question one or question two? Oh, I'll take them both. Come on. You want them both? Okay. I'll give you this. Name some of the NHL players that played in Wisconsin as a Badger. We'll get you that one. Okay. And the second I've one. I've got a few. There's a second part to this. How many are on the NHL roster and how many teams are in the NHL? How, how so many teams How many in teams the NHL? and how many players on each team? So oh, Jeepers Christmas. <laughs> I, <laughs> hey, you wanted a bolt. You, you got double barrel on that one. So we'll take a little 17 minute break and get everybody cleaned up, and we'll be back for the third period of hockey and some answers. I got some Googling to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. <laughs> All right, we're back at period number three, a 3-3 game, and we're going to get these trivia questions out of here quick. We were talking about them a little bit. So five players that played in Wisconsin, NHL. What do you got, Mark? Well, I have more than five <laughs> that I've, I have written down. Joe Pavelski. Here's a good one. Cole Caulfield. Yeah. And Joe played for the Sharks and the Dallas Stars. Yep. Cole Caulfield, brand new rookie with the Montreal Canadiens. You got Tony Granado and Don Granado, yep. brothers, brothers that played for there. the Badgers, and they both played in the NHL. Yep. Don, or, uh, uh, Bob Suter. Yep. In the 70, he was on the. He was actually on the. Uh, Miracle on Ice team too yep. for USA. Chris Chelios. Yep, big and black then, hawk. And then I looked, uh, I couldn't couldn't think of it. We got Brian Elliott, it's a goalie. Yep. And uh, uh, Danny Heatley, I knew, because he he was a one. He played as a freshman for the Badgers and then left. And yep. The only one I had that you didn't was Mike Ricker played Badgers oh, yeah. and went with the goalie. Got a cup with the Rangers. All right, so you got a good one. All right, now we're gonna stump you. You look those up. What do you got for the second? One. How many guys on the NHL roster? How many guys on an NHL roster? Yep. I shot well, high. You, you got, you've got, well, you got <laughs> Arts five, over five, here, all of them. <laughs> five guys on, five guys on a line. So usually you got three or four lines, you know, that you're playing. So you got to have over 20 guys on the roster. Oh. I would think. So it's got to be in the ballpark. Yep, you're you're right there. 22. 20. Okay, well, 20, 20 guys. Should have stuck with 20. Before they dropped the puck, we got 31 teams in the NHL right now. 30, and then Seattle came in this year. So here we go. Period number three. New ball game. 3-3. Three, three. Got the puck, and well, remember, come out of that and kind of with a hop, skipping, and jumping all over the place, and brings that back out to center race. That's the thing right now with that new ice. Everything kind of skates around. Ooh, Davis took that one right off the body. Dumped that down to the zone. That one scoots all the way around the corner. Brzezicki flips that back. Kirch takes that up. Kind of swung and missed a little bit on that check. But not Brzezicki. He made sure he connected with his. So the hitting has started 30 seconds in. <laughs> Davis back there. He flipped the oh, stick. Nice, that was a nice, nice little play right yeah, there. It was. Took his stick out from underneath him and ooh, Padgett fired oh, it in. Oh, Kirch just couldn't get <laughs> yep. a tip on that he was one. He was tied up with his uh, defenseman pretty good. I think Kirch got one off. I think that was off the leg. He almost looked like he had a little hobble, but yeah, it looks like he's all right now. Everybody at the line changed. McDonald collect that one up. He's coming around with a head of steam around the... Had the puck taken out. Bismente collected that back up. Back out to Padgett. Nice little bounce pass to Reese right on the tape. Mm. Well, that one's going to get everybody off. <laughs> that one went between two sets Piz of legs. Yeah, I was going <laughs> to say, Pismente and... Oh, just. <laughs> just. <laughs> I mean, I was watching that one, and he has a better view than I do by a couple feet, but... Ah, I mean, that's a pretty close call to get right there. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with he wasn't, but either way, face off up here. We get a set up. Yaku's dumps it down in there. Ooh, oh, that one actually dumped in off the. <laughs> See, that's the one that you know catch him off guard. 
Like that one, the angle he was at may have not went in, but the way it bounced off the ice, it very well could have. That would have been a strange goal that we definitely would have taken. Grano will get to come off for a meal on the faceoff. Ooh, Hogan, point blank. Yeah. That was Hit the post. bounce. It, I think he ricocheted yeah. that one in off the crossbar or off the inside one, and that's, that's Hogan right there. That's a big goal for him. We will take it. Absolutely. I'm not sure, but I don't know if that's, you know, I don't know if you got a chance to look at that one, Mark, but I'm not sure how many goals Hogan's got this year. I can look it up here in just a second. I mean, that'd be awesome. He's tearing right down there again. He wants to go for another one right away. Hogan Boyle, two goals, four assists. No, it would be Liam, Liam Hogan. Liam Hogan, one goal, four assists. So that might be his, that might be his second of the year. <laughs> What's the odds in that? Jordy got another assist. <laughs> Armino. Atta boy. All right, so the game is tonight. Nobody can score unless Jordy feeds him. <laughs> I'll take that. I mean, he's got assist on every goal tonight. So... We'll go with that. Now we're up 4-3. Oh, he tripped over the red line. <laughs> you know, those jump up once in a while. Wow. They get, the, the they get end, thicker. The end line, <laughs> not the center red yeah. line. <laughs> that road's back there with Blair. Yeah, Padgett and Grace are back there. Ooh, that was kind of a... He fell kind of backwards over 51 back there. He's, he's up all right, but... He had a, just a backwards bent his knee. That's Berglund. Mitchell kind of went down on that one. Mitchell King kind of, on the, kind of bouncing around the boards. Joe taking his guy, kind of. Well, kind of took him off the puck. He more just kind of, he did a little bit all weight on that one, so he couldn't get much of a, oh, that one's going to flip. Oh, that one made the stand. Somebody's got a souvenir. Yep. If I'm looking correctly, I think I know the little young man that got that puck. That might be the one I know, so eh, that's good for him. He's a new guy. So we'll get a face off here right glove side of Rum River here. Dave is out in the center there. Who comes out here to flip that back around. Brzecki back there. Still tying up each other. That one's going all the way around. Dave is back there. Tried to come around, but Kirich was waiting for him. Flips it off the steer. Back to Kirich. He rolls that one all the way around. There's two big boys back there battling it out. You know, between Brzecki, you know, and Stoner, they're both, you know, 200 pounders, six foot two, six foot three. They'll go, they'll go toe to toe. Rum River kind of get a little. Ooh, <laughs> Jordy's gonna need a big bucket of ice tonight. I'm gonna tell you that he took that one right off the body. <laughs> and Davis down there, he's got Brzecki tailing him. Ooh, tried to feed him, spun around, got another shot on him. Yeah. Adam. He's gonna he's gonna watch that one later and yeah. kick himself. Yeah. <laughs> that was a nice play. Jordy tied up those two guys. They you know on he took that check up there on the sidewall and they gave up that two on one and going yep. in and couldn't quite capitalize on it. But <laughs> Adam, if he takes maybe a split second more, that puck if he can get that under control, yep. he might be able to do a little more with it. But it was fluttering around. You got it on that though. Made him make a save. That's, That's right. Oh, that was a newcomer oh. with a nice little poke right there. Oh, <laughs> this is meant to bounce one. It just fluttered over the pad. But to get in, oh, that one, I was going to say, if Trent Keenan can jump that high, I would be impressed. That was about six feet over top of him. He yeah, kind of squatted down like he was going to go for it. A, jump that high, B, jump that high, and then come back down on your skates. <laughs> you know, yeah. Yeah, that's a whole different. <laughs> Most people can't jump that high with shoes on. He's going to come down on two little eighth-inch wide pieces of steel. Well, that one checked up. Ooh, that one's floating right in front. That one's still floating up in front. Gee, still floating up in front. There, he poke-checked it. Bismente down there. He's got Newcomer and Tranquina with him. Oh, that one got taken off, and nobody trailing him. Oh, he tried to get another one out of there. Oh, Brett's going to have a little one-on-one -on -one right now. See, there, he took his Good guy right off the play. puck. 
just dumped him right out of there. There to clear it out of the zone. <laughs> okay, so he dumped that guy to the ice there. No different than that play that they called it. <laughs> Ooh, Grano stole the puck. Oh, he tried to feed Hogan, but just <laughs> waited just a split second too long to get rid of that one. Boy, if that guy from Rum River, 22, if he did, you know, if he'd have looked, he had a two-on-one with Brett right there, and they just kind of dumped it. Oh, here we go again, Grano. Oh, oh, thank you, linesman. Well, he still got a puck on that one. Got it, got it down in there. He got but a he, puck on what? Yeah, on there. As <laughs> <laughs> they almost. Yeah. That's kind of like, you know, listening to you is kind of like watching these guys play hockey. It's really easy to, to oh, correct you when you do something wrong. Oh, it's you know, we've been how many games into this and still, you know, I got my hand tossed. I got everything, <laughs> you know. And that one's about head high. There, See, they're gunning for me again. You know, you make one mistake in these guys, I think they have six cents. You know, we talked this over and over. If anybody ever has announced or any trying to do a play-by-play, -play, and if you watch basketball, baseball, you get a kind of a play, you could take a little break, collect your thoughts. You have zero time here unless something like this, you know, they give you about five seconds to think about something. <laughs> and Zach's over here, maybe three. <laughs> and see, there's just steady action that you got to keep... Newcomer, a little wrist shot, right? I'm gonna say there's about a bruise, about a puck size, right about where that mallard is, because I think they've hit him about 50 times tonight. Well, how many shots in goal? 56. I'm gonna go with 50, 50 of them. them have been <laughs> right, have been in, right the in the. I mean, that's it. They've they've already beat last night's mark of two shots on goal, and we're still, you know, over half of a period to go yet. But Donald wanted. They're trying to get something going there. Yaku's gave a little slap of the stick, tried to keep it out of there. Fizz Mendy took his guy, run him into the boards, comes out of there. Just kind of fire that one to the old dump and chase for a little while. Steer collected that up. He flipped it up to Newcomer. Newcomer's going to split the defense. Tried a little, oh, oh. little fancy backhand, just almost got that. <laughs> Ooh, another big wrist shot. Where'd that come from? McDonald come around the corner and, you know. There was a gap there on the, between <laughs> that goalie and the pipe, and that puck almost, almost bounced over it. his almost bounced over his pad. Oh, a little chirping going on. I think they just. <laughs> they're gonna call it. Yeah, that is gonna say they. Yeah, they're gonna get Matt Howell for something. He was down there chirping a little bit, and like he said something to the official he wasn't supposed to, and. He ran them. <laughs> and I thought they could have put. They could have called a penalty on that last little breakaway that, put, that River Kings had, and not exactly <laughs> sure what they called here, but we'll get the rink announcers. Version <laughs> of it. It's funny because Jordy's over here talking to Howell. <laughs> Oh. Ah, 10 minutes. Ouch. So Jordy kind of came over here, knowing Matt Howell, kind of looked at him, he goes, what'd you do? <laughs> <laughs> that kind of shrugged his shoulders, so must have been, you know, something enough that, you know, the headline's been there just... You know, ran him up. I'll get the full story later on. They come back out here. Jordy passed up to Reese. So 21 is serving the two minute. Yep. He'll come out at 122. Yeah, 122 left, give or take. Yep. Jordy flips it back to Reese. He's coming up center ice. Coming off the far wing. Fighting two guys off the whole way down there. Bismenti comes back there. There, they're collecting stuff up. Get something set up. Yaku's out in the point. The newcomer and steer out there. Oh, Bismenti was point oh, blank. Left. Oh, he blew the whistle it again. Blew the whistle, and the puck was sitting right in the crease, right in the paint. And Bismenti was hacking away, and that puck was not covered. 
That's, I think that's about the third time they had an early whistle with the puck jumping around. They did it, I mean, they did it with Blackburn back there, which, you know, that one was that one. They've done it twice down here. So, so we'll get a new face off with Reese down there. He flips it out, newcomer. He has steer wide open in the corner. Oh. Holy cow, if Bismendi wouldn't have jumped, he, or ducked behind the net, I think he was going to have his head removed. <laughs> they got a little breakaway. Rum River. Davies gets the puck. Oh, he missed the puck. Coming out of there. Rum River collects it up. Yakuz blocks it with the, the boot, flips it up to newcomer. Davies has got it. Oh, Brzezicki. Oh. Go! Oh. <laughs> Brzezicki newcomer. collided with somebody dead center. When Newcomer was back down in there, oh, too. So Patrick we still got did a really good job holding the zone. Uh-oh. Foot race right now. <laughs> the the been, win. Ryan's been tripped over the red line. <laughs> He's kind of, kind of looked over at the head one going, I don't know what just tripped me. <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> Lost an edge. Yep. Kirch down there chasing assist Leano kind of ooh, Brzecki keeps it in with the skate. Almost the end of power play here in the first one. Ooh. Oh. Just <laughs> Kirch is standing there and one guy kind of come around the backside of him. Had his hand around his shoulder, like, hey, how's it hey, going? Hey, how you doing? <laughs> I'm gonna give you a little hug. Remember us? We were just fighting in front of the you know scoring bench like 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I think I won that fight. How about you? <laughs> Neither one of them ended up in the box, so I'd say they both won. Yeah. <laughs> so now we're back to full strength. Shit, we're hitting. Shit, 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 shit. 60. Where's that shots. seven second button? <laughs> <laughs> big, big button. That's where you just reel that one back. <laughs> 60 shots on goal. <laughs> it gets to be a long night <laughs> with this much going on. Rum River coming up. Oh, we do ride him off the Just puck. Just ride him. Yep. Siciliano. Ooh, tried to hit him on the on the tape and just hopped his stick on that one, but well. Kirch up there dumps it off to Davis back to Hogan. Ooh, big wrister. He went low, but that was that one right down the pad. So he saw something there. Didn't go high. He tried five hole, but I think he glazed one off to the right side a little bit. But well, well, that little hiccup back here in the defense event, you know, where it just burned a little time. I'll take that when you're up a goal. Oh yeah. You know, when you're down a goal, that. Yeah. Yeah, you can't hesitate like nervous. all that. Yeah. That gets tough. That gets harder on your defender. That was a a knuckleball from Yaku's right there. He tried to get a slap shot. Grano back there fighting. I, I tell you what, for. He didn't have a goal tonight. If he, you know, as far as it is, Grano has fought for every inch. Yaku's back behind the net. Hogan was looking right in the corner. He was kind of left alone, but he, Yaku's couldn't get the puck to him. Jordy fighting all over the place too. He's got, got oh, good deflection. Armillo got a stick out in front of him. Then 51 was on a breakaway. Ooh, that. Oh. oh, that one didn't clear out. I thought that one bounced over the line. Looked like it, but they shoot that one all the way around. This particular official. That is, one's going. That one's clear. Mitchell King back there chasing. <laughs> I have, oh! <laughs> I'm not sure if Brett was going for the hit and went to turn, but he missed and took himself right out of the play in that one. Well, we'll get a little line change, Rum River, and we're gonna go all the way down to Rum River end. No, we're gonna go right outside, right outside the zone on Rum River, far side of the ice for us. Yeah, Joel Blair taking a face off. Look at that. I would never thought to see that one, and got the face off win too. So they're bouncing around here. They tip one in, patch it down there, clicks it back up. Ooh, tried to catch Gracer on the cross. Mitchell King and Joel Blair just causing all kinds of havoc back there. They're chasing it right around. Gracer's down the corner, picked that one back up. Doing some little stick move there. Joel with the big shot. That one deflected off high. Oh, Ooh, nice kept hold. It, kept in there by Brett. 
That was a great hold at the blue yeah. line by Brett. That puck come out of there in a hurry, just hopping, and somehow got his leg and body in front of it to knock it down with 9.15 to go. Man, they're just shots on goal, 63. Still nine minutes to go. I mean, you look at, I mean, the goalie, I mean, Dotson right now, that's 63 shots, let four through. So a goal on average right now is crazy. I mean, and a lot of them have been hard shots. So it's not like he's, you know, having a bad game. It's just, they're just dumping shots in. <laughs> well, that, that is the theory. You, yeah. then, something good's going to happen when you keep dumping the puck on net. You, if you don't put the puck on net, you're never going to score a goal. I remember a few games a few years ago, I think uh, we had a shutout win with nine shots on goal against us. And I asked the goalie, I'm like, man, that's a pretty good shutout. He goes, yeah, but it's horrible because I only faced nine shots. <laughs> yeah, you get kind of bored back there. You're trying to hold your focus. Yeah. They're still bouncing around. Yaku's old center pass and got intercepted there by Rum River. I they had Reese and Pizmente dead, dead money in the front of the net there. And Yaku's is playing a little more forward right now. Newcomer's back here to kind of taking the spot, and Reese clicked that one up. Reese down again. Hmm. Clicked that one up. And they get a little bouncing off each other in that one. No, well, line's been looking over, just shaking his head. Nope. We're, he knocked you down. You eye for him eye down on that right one. Yeah. <laughs> they dumped that one down. They're going to try to get a quick Ooh. line change here, and that one kind of got left alone. Ooh, one on three, and Davis comes out of that one. Boy, he's quick. Yeah, he is. His first two he's steps on the ice, I mean, he's, he's just speed. explosive. Ooh. Oh, he hit him in the head. They're going to call the... Well, now they're going to call the whistle. That line's going to call, no, Jordy's looking like, how do you think my helmet popped off my head? Kind of lost at some of the calls. I mean, that was kind of a... Obvious? I mean, kind of threw an elbow up there and took his helmet right off of him. A little 752, we'll get in our face off. Dave's going to take that one. Kirik, Brzecki, Brett, and Cicilliano out there right now, and flops it off to Brett. Bounces off the board of Cicilliano. Ooh, they got a little tip on that one from Davis, went a little high. Kirich clucked that back up to Brett again. We're going to reset and try this one more time. Brett fires one in. Ooh, Brzecki tried to, he was, I think if that would have went in, I think they may have waited. He had the whistle in his mouth for that one. I think that may have been high, but. I don't know. He's a little taller than everybody else out on the ice. So how do you, you know, high, yeah. high stick and, you know, if it's below his shoulders, but it's above everybody else's, yeah. how, do you, how do you call that? <laughs> they got to have a medium. <laughs> like most of the time what they said is kind of the, the norm is basically crossbar. If it's above that, then they'll call it. But, oh, trying to let that one bounce off him. He wasn't sure where that one went. He collects that one, dumps off to Hogan. Ooh, he put a shot, just went wide on that one. Steer back in. Sends that one back in. Ooh, hard cross pattern. Yakuz just keeps that one in. That one, ooh, that was a wicked little bounce. Came off the high hit, off the stick, and just bounced over the net a little bit. Armillo back there fighting. Working hard. Two on three, and oh, they're going to dump it backwards. Kind of lost all momentum on that one. Rum River collects it and kind of, and they'll get icing on that one. They, they kind of, he kind of had a little breakaway, flipped the puck backwards. He kind of lost the whole momentum and then just dumped it down there. Kind of, he kind of looked disgusted for a second and just said, you know. No, we'll take it. Yep. We'll take it. We'll take it. Offensive zone face off. Up four to three with 6.31 to go. Joe's gonna take Joe Blair on the face off. You got Mitchell King steer. Gracer off on the other wing and Yaku's on the far side. Mitchell King back behind the net. Joe down there gives a little hand trying to keep the puck down in the corner. Still fighting for it down there. Remember trying to clear it out of there. Tried to bounce it behind Yaku's and he kept it back in there fighting. All right, let's see if we can get a Get an insurance goal here. Well, hey. well the Rum River guy is down on the ice a little bit. Oh, there's a big trip. 
Joel getting a little scrappy down there. Mitchell King kind of grabs him. Give him a little handful of snow. Yeah, that was a battle of the twos. Yeah, they're going to get a trip on that one. And the chirping continues all the way to the bench. Joe with his little smile. All right, let's go. This is where you so, get your, and you put some insurance up there. Oh. So I was just, I keep writing down penalties. So that'd be one, two, three, four. That's 12 tonight right now. We still got six to go. We've had a four minute, we got a 10 minute. We've had how many five on threes? Yeah. You know, it, it. We had a pretty clean game last night. A few, you know, couple trips. I don't think we had any interference, stuff like that. But we had a goalie interference. We've had, a, you know, kind of some different calls tonight. Newcomer floating around. Ooh, that. Oh. Biz Mendy in the corner tried to get a little chip. Ooh, nice save. Yaku's back here with a little backhand to steer. Tips that back to Newcomer. Newcomer about to enter the bench for Rum Riverside. I'd like to see him feed Yaku's with one forehand slap <laughs> shot. He's looking. Into the back of the he's bench. looking. Like right now, he's looking. Oh, he saw, he saw he, Reese coming he in he the slot put, right yeah, there. Yep. He's trying to hit him with the pass. You know, that's the one thing is... Oh, he just ticked the post. Yeah. It sounded like it ticked the Far post. Far left post. He missed that by an inch. He saw the window and he had a quick change. He had Davis out there, Siciliano, Pizmente steer, and newcomer still out there. So, quick change. <laughs> Jordy down again. We lost two helmets. Oh. I was gonna say, I thought they had. I thought they had to stop play when their helmets come off. Yeah. <laughs> and they let play go on. I mean, you got yeah. two guys out there with nothing on their heads. Yeah. How it happened? But both the helmets were off. Both of them are sitting on the ground, looking at each other, trying to figure out what happened. And that linesman finally blew the whistle, so we get a quick change here. 4:45 to go. 45 seconds left on the power play. We got Padgett, Brzecki, Davis, Kirich, Siciliano out there. Davis on the faceoff. Who clicks that one and Brzecki grabs that one. Who fired that one up in the net, deflected off. So we'll try that again. Ooh, 440 to go. One more little insurance goal would be really nice. Mm. I mean. Yes, it would. Yeah, you know, like we were talking yesterday too. I mean, we you said it earlier. Rum River, you know, they're in seventh right now, 20 points. This game does not show that. I mean, oh, Badger just threw his head back. It was a pass out to the point, and it just went right between the wickets on that one. So, they'll reset. Cicilliano coming up. He cross passes to Davis. He. Gets a little scoop shot, dumps her back behind the net. Now one's going to try to bounce all the way around. Paget oh, lost nice it guy. again. Siciliano does his job. He cuts his guy off, gets the puck back. Very nice. I mean, that is a ooh, big hard shot. Big rebound, though, but nobody could get there fast enough for rebound. Davis tried to center pass and nobody home. Back to even strength with just under four to go. Rum River comes skating in. Bunch of skates in his way. He wasn't going to get a shot off. They had his sticks tied up and his skates. Still fighting down there with three of them. Cicillano, Brzecki, and Rum River coming out of there. Oh, Reese just sprawled out, knocked it out of the zone. They're trying to get something going. They're going to both get line changes. Oh. And there's a whistle for that one. Is he going to call boarding? Interference. That one hurts with three and a half to go. That you don't want to do. Especially, especially when you know the little stuff that he calls. That's that's one you gotta you kinda gotta play the ref on certain things like this. I mean you can do your best and try, you know, adrenaline going what it is, but so we'll get two minutes of power play. And about the time that power play is done, there's a 
big old blast. Who was that? Had to be Akus. <laughs> I didn't even see who shot it. I don't even have to look. <laughs> it was a wound up and a, a big pop. So they kind of. Now what? They're calling. They called another penalty. There's their five on three again. You're right. He's got something. Yeah. Get it out of there. Here's the whistle. So what are they calling on this one? I don't know. <laughs> Slash. On Pizzamente. And are they calling timeout? Oh, River, Rum River's calling timeout, too. So they're going to try and draw something up here. You know, here's another one. You got a minute and a half of one penalty. Two on the other one, three minutes to go. Do you pull a goalie? Do you, do you run way lopsided and try to get a tie? You know? Not with hey. well, you're you're at five on three. I, yeah. I wouldn't see any. I mean, you, you, you almost you go for the. Well, I suppose he gives you. A, I mean, you're that's six, six on, on three. three. So I mean. So you've got the extra room on the ice. You don't. <laughs> you just hope for that. You know, that's that gamble you make. Do you do you gamble with the, you know, with the odd but man and leave that empty one, net? Yeah, but you give one one. All it takes is one. One little. That's where you need the O'Reilly Allen, big old wrist shotter from you know Crease. Hit about center ice and just trickle its way in. <laughs> that would that, see those are the that that, would be a gamble. That's that's a risk. Because all it takes nope. is one. No, they're gonna leave them out there. They're gonna go with the five on three, but we're gonna see how long that goes for. You know. So yeah, newcomer Steer and Yakus out there. The newcomer's gonna take face off. Kind of wiped out a bunch of guys in the process. Big old slap Let's shot. Get it. Newcomer checked that one out of there, tried to keep it at least a little bit cleared out. They're bouncing around, yeah, looking for something. Yaku's bouncing around there, still looking for something off on the point. Riley's they, trying to stand, he got a guy standing right in front of him. Yeah. That's the disadvantage of being down two man. You don't have one guy in the front clearing the cobwebs out in front of them there. They're still looking around. A minute to go with the first power. Still looking. Ooh, so, that one. Uh, there's a Yaku who took that one. And he just got a chip on that one. Yeah, he took one. Big pad shot. Ooh, that one tipped up. Jordy got that tip. 45 seconds. 2.15 left to go. You know, you watch more of these games, you wonder why people have ulcers and stuff like that. Cause, <laughs> I mean, they like the dramatics. I mean, we go to the, you know, the Hudson game, lost one in overtime on a marginal high stick call. We go back up to Hudson, win the first game, third, fell, you know, eight to four. That was, you know, and the next game we go overtime shootout. I mean, there they cleared her all. That was a good check there with 40 seconds left of that one. Just clearing two minutes left of the game. Ooh, and that one got chipped out. Still fighting for all of it. Yeah, Riley took that one off the chest. Oh, he didn't get enough on it. Didn't get nothing on that one. Uh -uh. That one rolled all the way down. Still looking for something. Paget, newcomer and steer. Still looking for something. Oh, oh. good block. Newcomer took that one off the chin. He's fighting for everything. He's still trying to clear it out. Seven seconds left to the first one. Reese has got a leg on the wall already, ready to burst out of there. Two, there's one, and he's coming out. Good clear. Ooh, and he comes right behind the Rum River guy. To get on that, get on that. Oh, that nice, nice poke. hustle. Badgett with a huge poke right there to clear that one out of the zone. There you go. Oh, that one hit a. Yeah, that was the highest stick, so nobody could touch that one. If you could have planned that one about perfect, and that's two seconds left of that penalty. Yeah, they pulled goalie, so we got a minute to go. Six on five for one minute. Oh, Brett, Brett has a chance right now. Oh, fired wide, but that's a rebound. Brzecki back there fighting with it. 45 seconds. Oh, they dumped it back behind the net. 
40 seconds to go. They're trying to do something. Siciliano got it here. They'll let Brett have another whack at it. He chips it. Oh, oh just oh. wide on that one. 30 seconds to go. Oh, and they call lights in. Yeah. He went from five on three to six on five, and it's like he <laughs> went from not looking like there was hardly anybody on the east, and now it's like, <laughs> wait a minute. There's guys everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> They're just winging off the bench. Ah, well, bring a whole team. It was making interesting. <laughs> Philly ice. <laughs> 20 on 20. Let's go. Holy cow. There'd be so many, there'd be so many bodies on the ground. Somebody would catch a stick where they didn't want one. Yeah. <laughs> They're trying to figure out the line right now. Prozecki is coming off. Newcomer come off. They're going to leave him out there. Reese is out there. Brett's out there. Pizzamente and Siciliano on the far side. Big check. They're going to try to clear something out here quick. 28 to go. Ooh, big rebound in front of the net. Ooh, Reese took that one off the... Riley had, up. had number five, knocked him right into the... Ooh, there's another one off the shin. That's yeah, going to clear out. 14. What? What's he... Yeah, they're going to get icing on there with 11 seconds to go. <laughs> so we're going to try this again. How's the blood pressure going? Yeah. <laughs> Time out, Wisconsin Rapids. <laughs> Just in case you wanted something else to sit there and think about. On a side note, the Packers game is 7-3 to three with 12 minutes in the fourth quarter and the second and goal Packers. I got Eric Kareen up here tonight. He's back here pacing like an expected father. <laughs> <laughs> he, he looks like a coach right now. He's like, oh, hands shaking, got a little twitch going on. <laughs> What would be worse, being on the bench right now or sitting up here? <laughs> he's, yeah, he's, he's saying it's worse up here. <laughs> he's up here like we are, hands in the pocket, pacing, kind of kicking the, kicking the ground a little bit, like, come on, come on. <laughs> so we got 66 to 26 shots on goal. You know, one thing I did not look, I did not see, I know we're back home next weekend, if I'm correct, if anybody can remember, yes. we are home. Next two weekends. Next two weekends. I'm not sure who we're back for next week. Anybody? Steel County next weekend? Yeah, we haven't seen them in months, so that should be something different. And then Minnesota Blue Ox, uh, February 4th and 5th. That's going to be a fight, too. Well, here we go, 11.2 to go. Reese down fighting. Oh, hand fake. He caught, he caught it. <laughs> he was trying to do the sleight of hand. What was it, Mark? Hand pass. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Zach are over here like, come on. You know the phrase. <laughs> hand toss. Pizza by Politos. 8.8 to go. The flare for the dramatic. I screwed it up. <laughs> <laughs> well, you say it the correct way. I'm the one that blows it every time, so. <laughs> yeah, but it's much more fun. <laughs> so they change it up. They put, oh, Steer tried to clear it. I think that, oh, Ooh. three, that's two, and that should that's be it. it. Yes. Big, big win for River Kings on that one. Take nothing away from Blackburn. Take nothing away from Mallards on this one. Hard fought. They have improved dramatically. So, the final four to three, 66 shots to 27. That's crazy. So, we are back here next weekend against Steele County, 7 o'clock Friday and I think 7 o'clock Saturday. So as far as Mark over here doing color and keeping me in check, Arts on Camera is our producer. Zach over here trying to be a you know 49ers fan for at least a day. <laughs> and Matt, big kudos to Matt. He came here early and fixed fixed that little technical issue we had yesterday. So another two big wins should get us a couple more points for the weekend. Most most we can hope for is you know blue box, but. Hey, and know the other thing we forgot about, who you got for your three players, Mark? Well, the assist master, Jordan <laughs> Steer. <laughs> he's, he's only got four. <laughs> I mean, every goal tonight, he was on the assist board for that one. Uh, who else went to bat tonight? Mine A lot was. Of dirty work, I don't think. Yeah. 
I was going Hogan on that one for yeah, Liam Hogan, Hogan with his goal. Yeah, with the goal, he's going to get one. I mean, one. you got, you also got Kirich back there with a the goal. So they've both been, you know, you got Kirich, you got Grease, Hogan, a newcomer, all with goals. I know I sometimes I like. I'm going to go out on a land. I'm going to say Kobe Brett. Just Ooh. because yeah, hard work, just always did. So I see stuff. Hogan? No, it's Kirich, Kirich. Hogan, and Steer. I, I tried going out on a limb. I hate being <laughs> predictable. Well, maybe Nuke. Newcomer, maybe? Yeah. Kirich and maybe Hogan. Steer, for, maybe Steer. Nope, is, there it is. Maybe Steer is too obvious. You know, yeah. You know, nope. Him doing four assists, that's nothing. <laughs> no. You know, I mean, he just, that's just what he does. That's Saturday. You know? <laughs> 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 I mean, the guy is a points leader, the assist leader of all, you know, defensemen for USPHL for a reason. So, but very well deserved, Kirich, newcomer. Like we said, we can go through the line again with six guys down there that every night do their job. Ground down there, you know, everybody. So, all right, that'll do us for tonight. Glad we got everything taken care of. We're going to be back again next week and hopefully the same outcome. As far as everything else, we're out of here. Keep your stick on the ice. Absolutely. Have a good night. Good night.